We finally got to see the sun shining bright today. Felt good. The temperatures, they're not quite summer, but it was the best we've had so far this week. But even with all the sunshine and the warmer air, ice is still a problem. Here's meteorologist Annie Brown to explain how sublimation works when it comes to ice. The sun is finally out and temperatures finally above freezing. Now we come to the 40s this afternoon, very pleasant, which is helping to melt away some of this icy and dicey weather parking lot here at our station has greatly improved in a short amount of time. Now a lot of this ice will be converted into a liquid, but there's also a process taking place that's bypassing the liquid phase. This is called sublimation, where some of the ice will go directly into a gas phase rather than a liquid state. Reporting live from the parking lot, meteorologist Annie Brown, T-News Weather.